x squared minus 6x minus 8. Minus 28. Today, we're just using our outdoor basketball court as a giant coordinate plane. Where's that x squared minus? Our y scale is by twos. It's easier to visualize it if it's on the, like, in real life, not just on a piece of paper. The boys are representing the points on a graph, and I show them an equation and they run to where they are. The hardest is doing it in your head if you don't have a piece of paper, so you have to do like quick like math, like nine squared and stuff like that. It's a real advantage of Landon to be able to have the flexibility to make sure that classes are always engaging and moving so that the kids can really internalize this. When we do it in real life, it's more active and it's more entertaining. So if, like, if you don't do it on the test, you could definitely like, remember back to when you do it like out here. Next equation. 1 half x minus 7. When we came to fractions, we really had to use some of the brain power. Just the culture of teaching here in the middle school is to do whatever you can do to make sure that the boys have every opportunity to succeed. Positive, negative, 0, 1, 5. All right, now one more equation. One more equation.